Hey, this is Wesley with Millwright CNC. Today I'm going to show you a little bit about the Mega V Full Sheet. The Mega V Full Sheet has a 50 by 98 inch work area with a 3.75 Z travel. Like the other Mega V's, this one will also sport the steel rack and pinion system on the XY with the lead screw and anti backlash nut on the Z. The Mega V full sheet also has custom v-wheels to ride along the custom extrusion on this machine the y rails are obviously much longer and will require a mid-span brace ours is 12 millimeters thick aluminum and will keep that sag out of the middle of the rail the mega v can come with optional skirt panels and an optional rotary fourth axis. This current machine has the panels removed on the left and the back because we were crawling under it working with the vacuum table that you see. That vacuum table is made out of three quarter inch starboard probably a little thicker than what you would need uh, you could easily make one with a half or maybe even a quarter inch if you were careful this one has 0.2 inch grooves around the outside and in that grid pattern formation that is to allow us to put gasket material in there to produce a good strong seal this vacuum table is working in conjunction with a six horsepower shop back and that is generating more than enough suction to keep a three quarter inch mdf spool board and a three quarter inch mdf workpiece attached to the rear of the machine i mean that six horsepower shop back will also work just as well for a full sheet of MDF and a full spool board. The Mega V full sheet is running a DeWalt 618 2 and a quarter horsepower router. Uh, the DeWalt 618 will hold up to half inch tools and smaller. We are using one inch PVC to connect the shop back to the vacuum table. The project we are running is a 36 by 20 by 14 and a half inch tall coffee table. We are carving the top just to make it look a little bit more interesting. Those designs were made by taking the features on top of the table and the outside and the edge and doing one inch inside offsets, uh, progressive offsets until we filled the table top. This was done using Betric B Carve. Uh, obviously the pro version as the desktop limits you to a 24 by 24 inch work area uh, much more than what we need here this table will feature a mid span cross member and two side cross members as well as two legs uh, you can see the features of the cross members will uh, fit into the holes on the tabletop and uh, some persuasion may be required to get everything to fit snugly we are running the machine at reduced feed rates uh, for this project just because it's a test piece uh, mainly featuring the, the vacuum table. We wanted to make sure that that everything was being held down 
correctly and that no shifting occurs. Uh, everything's going great. Looks really good. I, I think this will be uh, a great option for uh, people of the larger machines. Uh, you should be able to run at a much higher feed rates than what we are showing here. Vetric has a nesting feature. Uh, right now we are only running one table, but if, uh, if I nested it appropriately, I could probably fit three of these tables onto one sheet of MDF. And uh, if I wanted to make larger, more well-proportioned tables, I could probably fit two of those on a full sheet. Thank you for joining us today. If you have any questions about the Mega V full sheet, please email us at sales at millwrightcnc.com or call our sales line. We appreciate all our customers. We appreciate you watching today, and uh, we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.